one to unit two. What? We're home. Base one to unit one. Base one to unit one. Hold it, you mother! Hold it! Police! There's been a break in at Democratic headquarters. They were bugging the place. Woodward. Bernstein, you're both on the story now. Don't get out. Redford. I'm Bob Woodward of the Washington Post. Mr. Markham, are you here in connection with the Watergate burglary? I'm not here. Hoffman. Hi, uh, this is Carl Bernstein of the Washington Post, and I was just wondering if you can remember... All the President's Men. The story of the two young reporters who cracked the Watergate conspiracy. White House. Howard Hunt, please. He might be in Mr. Colson's office. Who's Charles Colson? Did you know uh, Howard Hunt? Well, the White House said he was doing some investigative work. What do you say? They stumbled into leads. Certainly it comes as no surprise to you that Howard was with the CIA. No, no surprise at all. They tripped over clues. We'd like to see all the material requested by the White House. All White House transactions are confidential. This whole thing is a cover-up. It's right on our nose. And piece by piece, they solve the greatest detective story in American history. There is no way the White House can control the investigation. I, I don't want to say any more, okay? Have you been threatened if you tell the truth? Is there a cover-up? Don't you understand what you're on to? Mitchell knew? Of course, Mitchell knew. Woodward! Bernstein! Get in here! At times, it looked as if it might cost them their jobs. You guys are about to write a story that says the former attorney general, the highest ranking law enforcement officer in this country, is a crook. Their reputations. Why is the Post trying to do it? I don't know. Perhaps even their lives. read the Count of Monte Cristo lately. I read a little bit of it every night. I read words like revenge, sweet lasting revenge. I don't want you getting in any trouble. Come on, Father, you know I never do. That's all I wish for you and your friends. That's it? That's it, nothing else, I swear. Four friends raised in a legacy of crime. Everybody says this place come for jobs. Who is everybody? You think running for King Benny's a good idea? Huh? Pace. A lot of things, Pace. Not like this. Childhood prank resulted in an accident. The court hereby sentences you to no less than one year at the Wilkinson Home for Boys. The punishment. You gotta have rules and you gotta have you gotta discipline. discipline. Was far more than they deserved. It's a lot of power to have over a boy, isn't it? I don't want anybody to know. So might as well not even talk about it. The truth stays with us. Years later, they bound together. He went in there and he asked for the case. Now you tell me, what the hell kind of friend is that? In a pact to avenge those who destroyed their innocence. You still sleep with the light on? What are you saying, Mike? It's payback time. It's our time. I don't think you know the meaning of rules. Rules! You understand? We need somebody to take the stand. So you figured if you had a priest, it would be perfect. Not just any priest. This is a murder case. I am afraid that I'll make a mistake. And you'll go down for the dirt map. No one knows if I did this information. And I mean nobody. How did you get it? It fell into my lap. The priest wouldn't lie, am I right? Has anyone ever questioned your word before today? No, but there's a first time for everything. Sleepers, based on the controversial bestseller. Nico Toscani, he's a covert agent trained to survive in Vietnam. He has a master six-degree black belt in Aikido. And family 
in the mafia. He's a cop. Stop the cop! With an attitude. Do you know why I love you? You don't live the way other people live. You officially suspended this guy. Feds come in, the doors close, nobody hears, smells, or sees anything. One man. You just made number four on the most wanted list. One obsession. I want to be number one. One rule. You guys think you're above the law. You ain't above mine. Above the law.